Hello and welcome. This is the scene here at Molyneux. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. The initial 11 for Wolves. Pablo Sarabia starts with Pedro Nieto out wide. And the striker today is Fabio Silva. And this is how Liverpool will line up. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Thank you for attending today's game at the Molyneux Stadium. Enjoy the match. And so the match is underway. Gakpo. And slipped through beautifully. Oh, a tremendous block. Keeper getting the touch. Just the clearance that was needed. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? That was a tremendous save after a wonderful free kick. Liverpool corner given. Favouring the short one. Able to get a body in the way. Going short. Matty. Determined defending. Mateus Cunha. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Well, thumped clear. Well, whatever way you slice it, Stuart, Mo Salah is a man you just can't take your eyes off. I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders, he's got that ability to run with the ball into open space, he can pick out a pass, he can wriggle out of tight situations. He's the most creative player on the field today. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Andrew Robertson. So Bosloy. Salah. Intelligent threaded pass here. Oh my goodness! He's caught that so well! A goal of the highest class! Fantastic technique! Well, let's see it again, because the delivery is absolutely perfect. Hard and low, just inviting someone to run onto it. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So the action continues, and work to do for Wolves. Let's see if that goal has shaken them up. 
Silva. Traore with it. And options in the centre. Cunha. This could square the game. Reading it well. Is it going to be? Keeper did his job to begin with. Well, nothing untoward happened. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like this. Andrew Robertson. And Diaz has it. And Salah! Just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect and the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, as the stats confirm, Liverpool had the lion's share of the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. And they're making a change. So Bosloy. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Not much time to make up his mind. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Well, the story of the first half has been written. It is half-time now here at Molyneux. And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Yeah, I've been really disappointed with him today, Derek. He just hasn't looked himself. But I think it's fair to say he hasn't had great service, has he? So, back in business. Wolves' difficulties there for all to see in the first half. How do they respond now? Strong but fair tackle. Mo Salah. Alexander-Arnold. So, Bosloy. Gakpo and a long way out determined defending and a substitution in the offing taken short Salah Mati can he make it count? And there it is! Three goals in front now. An immense performance. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. So the action underway again. It's all going Liverpool's way. It's starting to get out of hand, you just feel. Cunha. 
has the strength to hang on to it. Matt Doherty, and he's in. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. And we have 30 minutes to go. And blocked for now. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Who can he pick out? Well, still an issue here. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Nuri. Max Kilman. Doherty has it. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And a goal kick given. Trent Alexander-Arnold. Now Mo Salah. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Alexander-Arnold. Now with Salah. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Craig Dawson. And into the last 15 minutes of action. And a decent delivery. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. And a strong tackle. Doesn't want to give it away here. Free kick awarded then by the referee. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Craig Dawson. Nelson Semedo has it. Excellent ball over the top. Sarabia. Lemina. Cunha. Well, really, making the goalkeeper's life simple. That should be hit in the back of the net. That was a big, big chance. Nelson Semedo. Doherty has it. Cunha. Lemina. Is it going to be Lemina? And there it is. A goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Grafenberg showing a lot of guile there. And that is that for this game anyway. And Wolves not taking anything at all from the match. How did you see it? Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team. And they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.